what's up guys we straight to out here with another gameplay from of modern warfare 2 so guys today um i'm bringing you guys my hello video from your newest um a-list director and you know obviously the message saying you want to be a-list director i'm like um hell yeah so yeah i'm the new lgu a-list director and i hope to bring you guys more entertaining game so i haven't posted on lgu in a while so most guys most of you guys won't really know me but you know i bring pretty aggressive gameplay you know i'm a very in the modern warfare 2 community i'm like the aggressor i'm very aggressive and i'm I don't, i'm not a big kd kd guy so i just most likely rush in a lot and you no know, i get i get i do work i get my things done but most, most, most of all, um, I enjoy playing the game, and this is what I, well, this is what I like to do. So today, guys, I'm bringing you a game with the Tor 21, and my perks are Slider Hand Pro, Stopping Power Pro, and Ninja Pro. I'll be playing a, a game of Domination in one of my favorite old school maps, Vacant, which is pretty awesome. I don't know why. I just like all the, you know, all the. It, you know this this map kind of suits my type of gameplay because I like all the like close quarter um, reaction combats. If you understand what I mean, like a lot of stuff that happened in this map is of reaction, like, and, and it's close. And it's, you know it's very action packed. I really enjoy playing games like this, which are pretty fun. So, um, of Aiken on domination, what well, you mostly want to do the best. What I found out that the best things to capture would be A and B, because to spawn trap them on on C is that's a it's a very easy spawn trap once you capture A and B, cause from the, for them to get out of C is pretty darn hard, because there's only two hallways where they could come from and you know the range of those hallways is pretty easy to hold down because they're so small. So one of the places is that door right there. A lot of people once they spawn, they go right there. And what you want to do, you can stand behind this um copy machine and shoot anybody that goes there and like you will see me do i do a lot of in this game i do a lot of that i just stay right there and take them out but for some reason i can't stay still so i gotta rush in so the best we, the best way to rush in is to you know close stuns and then make yourself with uh, make yourself there so um i want to talk a little bit about myself um I'm um, Restricted R, formerly known as Rated R from my past um, OGU videos. And I'm um, from New York. I'm 20 years old, even though my voice does not sound like I'm 20 years old. But, you know, I'm pretty... I have some type of age on me. And I'm a college student. So, like, um, you know, I'm Latino, I'm Dominican. And on a lot of videos that I posted in different channels and stuff, I get a lot of hate being called a Mexican, uh, a wetback, all that, all that crazy stuff. But you know, I, I, I mostly actually don't, I don't pay mind to it. I just ignore those comments. And you know, I enjoy making commentaries. And you know, I enjoy playing. I'm, I'm a gamer, so I enjoy playing Modern Warfare 2. So you know, all the hate and stuff like that, I just completely ignore it. Um, you know, I'm 20 years old. I'm pretty mature enough to ignore all those, all those comments. Cause, you know, some people, like younger people, they, they they take, they take comments. You know, to younger people, like speech could really hurt them. What others say about them and stuff, because they're, you know, as a young kid, you want everybody else to accept you as for who you are. So you know, everybody tries to build up, build up like this kind of image that you want people to see when they see you. But you know, once you start getting older and stuff, you realize that I don't know. You just realize that that really doesn't matter. Like how people see you, like you know, high school and middle school students, you know, they want to be like cool and stuff. Like you don't want people to oh, he's cool and stuff. But once you grow up, you 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 know, you come to realize that that really doesn't matter. And it's all about you know what type of person you are. It's not what you make yourself seem to other people that you are like if you understand what i'm trying to tell you well i'm kind of running away from model with it too so let's get back to the gameplay so um i have the tar 21 with fmj and 
I like to run around without. No, I'm a raw player. Like I, by raw, I mean I never silence my weapon, which is you know silencing your weapon is cr is critical to um you know keeping you alive. Cause walking around with a, with a silenced weapon, it really saves you a lot. But I don't know. I I, I, I like. I like all the, you know, all the people rushing into me and all the quick reactions I gotta make in order to survive. I like I like that type of gameplay. You know, even though I do die a lot because of that, because I don't walk around with a silencer, I still always do. Because, you know, in the long run, that... the long run, it makes you a, a much better player because you learn how to, you know, you learn, you learn how to react to all type of situations that you may be, you may be put in in in, Call, in the Call of Duty world, well you know playing Call of Duty, you learn how to do you know how to master all those reactions in certain places and stuff like that. So um, the top 21, as you probably heard from a million other people, best way you know you could I other people used to say from far away you could you should you know you should burst it like M16, but Bursting the gun, this gun, as you could hold down the trigger on this gun with no problem. Cause this gun is, you know, it's pretty accurate, pretty accurate. Basically, by holding the trigger down. And I, I, I play um GB, which is um for you guys if you don't know, is game battles. And by competitive players, this gun is used a lot. Just basically because of you know it's very mobile gun. And it's a two bullet kill. It's a two bullet kill with um stopping power. Which is the best part about it. Even though, you know, compared to the ACR and stuff like that, the accuracy is not, you know... I mean, not the accuracy, because the recoil is not the best. But uh, the more you use the gun, the better you learn how to master it. So that goes to every single gun. Like, the F2000, you know, to everybody, it is a crappy gun. But, like, let's say, if you was to give it a chance, you find out that, you know, that, that gun really has a lot of potential. It has a lot of potential. Like, I used the gun in a search and destroy, and I went, what was it, 15 and 3? For the first time. But I'm like, oh wow, this gun could actually do work. But then again, oh, he got a triple spray on us. <laughs> but then again, all my shots on that game were all like close range drop shots and, you know, behind shooting people from behind, so it really didn't mean much. So, um, in Domination. You know, pe people play. How, how this is how people some that like, you know. This is how Modern Warfare 2 players play domination. You have the players that just run around, trying to pick up, trying to pick up kills and stuff. Then you have other players that you know they move slowly around the map, trying to build up the kill streaks. Then you have objective players, which run to the flag every single chance that they get, and try to do you know what what what. what what the type of gameplay it is, the what the objective is of the of the gameplay. So I noticed. Um, I want to apologize to you guys for, you know, I know I do have kill streaks, but I'm not a big kill streak player, and I don't know. I like to. How can I say this? I like to challenge myself. I'm not saying I'm I'm better than anybody, but I just like to challenge myself and you know push myself to the limits. So. Basically, I don't use kill streaks. I, I I do have them activated because I will I will most most some mo like sometimes I'll call I'll call all of them in at the end of the game. You know, just to get get the points and stuff. And obviously, that guy is a uh, you know he's a pretty good player. You saw how he commanded me. So I hope you guys enjoy this type of gameplay. And you know, if you guys like want me to use any type of guns, just write in the comments. And also, que also question: What will you do if you have Modern Warfare 2 to play? What other game will you play? Write it right in the comments.